So today we're going to start our trial on the grass. We've got just a pretty typical backyard lawn here we're going to treat. Nothing really special about it. What we're going to do is apply one bucket per thousand square feet. Here we have 2,400 square feet. And so we're going to apply two buckets of our premium biochar, less than two millimeter. We're going to apply that first and then we're going to top that off with some nursery land premium um, food, lawn food. It's 3106. Half will be with biochar and fertilizer. Half will be just fertilizer. So we'll be able to see if the biochar is making any difference. And put this whole bucket in there. So that's 10 liters of biochar for a thousand square feet. So here we are in the grass trial and I couldn't be happier with the results. Uh, it may be hard to see in the camera, but to my right you have the fertilizer and biochar mixture and to my left is just the fertilizer. Now this up to the fertilizer, um, it's looking I think better than it used to, but there's still lots of brown spots um, and kind of uh, thinner areas that haven't been filled in. Uh, we cut them at the same time. We gave them the same amount of fertilizer, but with the biochar treated area, there are no brown spots anymore. <laughs> uh, this is only after one week of application. Um, I have the sprinkler set right in the middle between the two uh, tr areas. And so it goes around in a circle. It gives equal amount of water to the whole area, but it's like night and day between the lush thickness of this area versus this area. Um, so hands down, um, no argument in terms of if the biochar is making a difference, um, absolutely is. You're getting a, a thicker grass, uh, taller grass. I cut this at the exact same time and we got taller grass over here. The clover, um, is actually flowering over here and over here you have none, which goes to show a little bit more about, um, the the health of, of the plants and, and how fast they're growing and, and getting to, to their uh, fruiting stage. So um, night and day kind of between this, even after one week. So that's that's pretty encouraging. To be honest, uh, it looks kind of weird. I'm probably going to apply biology here, but in the name of science, we're gonna keep it rolling uh, throughout the summer so that you can see the difference between biochar and just fertilizer in and of itself. So right again, biochar fertilizer and just fertilizer. All right, so I'm super excited about this right now. This is a little over a week now of our trial on the grass. Behind me here, we've got the biochar, on, and on the left is just the compost. So we are going to mow it now. I'm gonna mow this side and collect all the grass and weigh it, and then I'm gonna mow this side, collect all the grass and weigh it, and we're gonna see how much volume difference this side is from this. This side looks a lot taller, looks a lot greener and healthier, but Ultimately, we'll see what, how it compares in terms of weight and actual foliage produced over the last week and a bit. All right, here we are. We're gonna just weigh this bucket. So it is 1.02 pounds. So we're just gonna put this grass into this bucket here. We're gonna see the difference here between this pile and the other pile. As you can see, it fits quite easily in this bucket. And I don't think, I don't know if we're gonna fit the other bucket in even in here. Two point five four. Now we're gonna do the next bucket. 
All right, as you can see, this pile is, is much bigger. Seven pounds. <laughs> That's, I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. I wasn't, I did not expect that good of a, of a result difference. I mean, you look at that side of the lawn, I don't know, maybe it looks better than it used to. But this, for heaven's sakes, most certainly does. Even the dog likes it better. 